Here he did damage to this Roadrunner team as well. Oh, and he gets him at some high cheese. Nice pitch there by Dobrash to pick up his first strikeout in this game. So the right-hander looks in, runner goes. Was not being held. Oh, and a late call, but it is strike three. Dobrash. First pitch swinging into left field. Schmidt, this time all the way to the fence and over the fence. That ball just carried. Welcome to mile high. And the Roadrunners are up one to nothing on the solo shot there by Ralston. They're going to be starting their season here in a few weeks. And a nice pitch by Dobrash getting the strikeout. That's out number two. Cancel games, postpone games, and you just got to keep your mind right. And a big pitch from Dobrash. High heater. It's third year with MSU Denver. Batting from the left side. Runners go. Right field. Will it land fair? It will. Big hit there from Peters. One run comes around. They're going to send the runner all the way from first. That must have been in the corner. And the Roadrunners tie things up on the two-run double by Cade Peters. Nice stare down from Nankis. The runner goes, throws it down, and gets the runner. Stone firing a bullet over to second base. Anderson puts down the tag and puts an out on the board. This is only game one of this four-game set. Nice off-speed, Nantkis gets the strikeout, his second of the inning. First pitch, swing and a base hit. Outside the diving arm of Olsen, one run comes in. Everybody moves from station to station, and Paschke picking up the RBI single to cut this lead to within one. Nantkis, left-hander, fires it in. Gets him swinging, and the strikeout, strikeout number three for Nankis. And gets him swinging. Makes the tag, big strike out there for Nankis. He's now up to four Ks in his three innings of work. And this lifted into left field, going a long way. Schmidt to the fence, and it's over the fence. The home run by Jake Williams gives his team an eight to seven lead. First pitch swinging, sends that down the left field line. Off the foul pole, the two run shot by Owen Reynolds. Everybody was looking to see if it was gonna be fair or foul and it hit the foul pole and the Roadrunners take a 10 to seven lead, Owen Reynolds. This one lifted into right center field and the outfielder just gonna watch as that one clears the fence. Back-to-back -back jacks by MSU Denver. Colin Stone getting into the hitting act. And this one's sent into center field, and that one's going to get out of here. Scott watches it as it clears 400 feet, and the two-run jack by Ralston. Versus Sioux Falls in that same year. And this one jacked the left field, and all Schmidt can do is watch as Owens connects for his second long ball of the day, his second in two innings, and the long ball continues to be an asset for MSU Denver. It is 15 to 10. Runners at first and second. Fort Hayes trying to rally down by five. Ackerfeld looks in the big righty. He'll fire it in, runners going, and gets the big strikeout. Big pitch there from the junior. And line out. Can he get it to first in time? They do the double play. Ackerfeld gets the line out over to Anderson, who makes a great play in his new position for 2021. And the Roadrunners start this season 1-0 after a 16-10 win over Fort Hayes State.